Hi everyone, I hope you're good. Uh, my name is David Mwanza Jr. I'm a psychotherapist and I'm on the show today with uh, The King's Manual. So today we'll be talking a bit about mental health and Christianity and how these two come together and get a better understanding of that. A bit of background on who I am. Um, as mentioned before, psychotherapists coming from an organization called Thrive Wellness Hub, okay? And we provide mental health services within uh, Lusaka. Also internationally, we've allowed ourselves to grow and innovate because of the COVID pandemic by providing phone therapy to clients across the world. So I've been in practice for about four years now, dealing with issues around anxiety, depression, trauma, suicidal ideation, thoughts about suicide and substance use. So um, let's get into today's session and it's just giving a bit of an introduction towards what we're trying to achieve and talking about mental health and Christianity and how these two come together, okay? So I'll begin by defining uh, both. So for mental health, mental health is basically an, a self-awareness understanding your limitations and also understanding your strengths and how these affect your day-to-day -day living and responsibilities all right and then when we come to christianity christianity is basically being christ-like having belief and faith in jesus christ as your savior to redeem you from sin and death all right summaries i know some of you educated people go deeper than that but i just keep it keeping it basic for now. All right. So now one general theme I've come to understand and believe about mental health and Christianity is that they both aim to transform. The Bible says that in, in Romans 12 verse 2 that do not conform any longer to the patterns of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. And that's the key point, the mind of which both Christianity and mental health aim to address. You know, there are certain ways that we think that affect the way we live, for the better or for worse. And because of those certain mindsets that we have, we need to address them, we need to renew them, we need to change them. And as we begin to do that, we transform into better people, into the people we want to be in life, right? So that's a basic definition on the two. And moving forward in the series, we'll begin to touch on certain symptoms, certain problems that are being faced and how the mental health dynamic and Christian dynamic may have impact in those areas. So please stay tuned uh, and um, follow through. If you have questions, please feel free to comment, to like and to subscribe. So thank you so much and good day.